In this video, we'll be talking about unit multipliers. A unit multiplier is a fraction that equals 1. Now, this is different from fractions that equal 1 in that unit multipliers require units. So, some fractions that equal 1 would be like 2 over 2, 5 over 5, negative 1 half over negative 1 half. So all of these fractions all equal 1 because they have the same value in the numerator and the denominator. Now unit multipliers also equal 1, but some common unit multipliers would be 1 foot over 12 inches. Again, we have the same value, 1 foot and 12 inches are equivalent measures, and so they're equal values in the numerator and denominator. But if we remove the units here, then our numbers would be 1 over 12, and that's no longer equal to 1. So for a unit multiplier, you have to have these units on the uh, numerator and on the denominator. And they have to be the same measure. So um, notice here, 1 foot over 12 inches, and then 12 inches over 1 foot. Both of these are unit multipliers, and you'll use whichever one benefits you. So if you uh, need the inches in the numerator, you'll use this one. If you need the inches in denominator, you'll use this one. Another example would be one hour over 60 minutes. And again, you know, if you remove those units, you no longer have a, a fraction that's equal one. Some equivalences that you should know, one foot equals 12 inches, one yard equals three feet, one mile equals 5,280 feet. And then our metric system, one meter is a thousand millimeters. The abbreviation for millimeters is MM. Notice no period behind the MM, just MM. Um, one meter is also a hundred centimeters and one kilometer is a thousand meters. Now some uh, equivalences that may be new to you, which you need to learn, um, one inch is equivalent to 2.54 centimeters. So we can, again, since we have this equivalence, one inch equals 2.54 centimeters, we can use that as a unit multiplier. So one inch, 2.54 centimeters, or um, 2.54 centimeters over one inch. Now this is a handy unit multiplier for if you need to convert from the English uh, system of measurement to metric system of measurement. So, you know, if you're going from miles or yards or feet or inches and you want to get to millimeters, centimeters, meters, kilometers, then you can use this as a bridge to get from one to the other. Very handy unit multiplier to remember. Another one that um, is very handy to remember is one cubic centimeter is equal to one milliliter. I brought uh, some things to help you see that. Um, this is a cube and it measures one centimeter. And you can see how big it is, about the end of your uh, little finger. And that 
this eyedropper, uh, you'll notice this mark right here is the one milliliter mark. So this cubic centimeter is about equivalent to one milliliter. So though that's a way to This is a handy unit multiplier to remember if you want to go from um, a volume measurement, this is volume, cubic centimeters, to uh, capacity, this is uh, milliliters. So that's, that's a way to jump from one to the other. And again, uh, you can use the one cubic centimeter and one milliliter unit multiplier, or you can uh, reverse that. They're both equal to one, one milliliter and one cubic centimeter. By the way, I think your cubic centimeters are also abbreviated as CCs. So if you ever watch a hospital shows or anything and they talk about so many cc's I think that that's your abbreviation for cubic centimeters and then also um, one hour is 60 minutes and one minute is 60 seconds um, this by no means is an exhaustive list so if you ever need to convert um, you'll, you'll want to check a dictionary or uh, Google it or somehow find your conversion equivalents.